We've recently been working on our new types of artificial materials that we structure at the nanoscale. Our latest development is a material which consists of uh, millions of tiny silicon nanopillars. Each individual pillar is up to 500 times thinner than a human hair. Our new materials perform uh, interesting operations with the light that um, shines onto them. And we recently created holograms with these materials. You might be familiar with them from Star Wars movies. Essentially, we are working on the same physical principles that once inspired uh, science fiction writers. Essentially, holograms are devices that perform by far the most uh, complex manipulations with light. In particular, they are able to capture and then reproduce uh, the whole information that light carries in full three dimensions. If you compare them to conventional uh, photographs or computer monitors, then those reproduce only a portion of information of light, uh, basically just the intensity of light, and in two dimensions only. If you think of those conventional optical components like lenses and prisms, then these are bulky and, and heavyweight. And essentially, uh, to make these components, we use technologies that haven't been changing for centuries. But with our new material, we can create um, components with the same functionality, but that would be essentially flat and lightweight. And this brings so many applications, starting from further shrinking down the sizes of cameras in, in consumer smartphones and all the way up to space technologies uh, by reducing the uh, size and weight of complex optical systems for satellites. Photonics in 21st century is playing an important role, uh, just like the electronics in 20th century. And uh, we are currently having many changes. And using this uh, holographic principle, uh, it is the ultimate solution to many uh, photonic problems and uh, its application is only limited to your imagination.